This is one of the traditions people think about most at Christmas time, coming to get a tree at the lot. Well, life doesn't take a break for the holidays, so some people who have hit a rough patch haven't gotten to put a tree up at all. So this lot is helping to fix that without charging these people a dime. For Randy Fitch at Fresh Cut Oregon Trees in Ahwatukee, his tree lot has always been more about people than profits. Juana's asked for trees, the festival lights, we give them trees, so it's a lot of fun. So when Connor Hogan with Ahwatukee Christmas Tree Removal approached them about donating some trees to people in the community, Randy was all on board. And it was just a beautiful thing that he's, he's got nominations, a lot of them, which is hard to find the right people to, to give the trees for. They all kind of vary. I'm very touching on some of them, so um, I really enjoy reading them. And Amy McDonald read about it on Facebook and didn't hesitate to nominate her mom, Ellen. She's my everything. Everything. She's my rock. And uh, I credit everything that I have today from her. She explained how her mom was diagnosed with stage four breast cancer this year. The chemo and cancer took such a toll on her health, she was unable to work. So Connor, Randy, and their crew picked out the perfect oh, tree. Right. Sound good? Go with it. Gave it a fresh trim and took it straight to Ellen's house. How sweet. They set it up, strung it with lights, and trimmed it with ornaments. It's very pretty, and I love the smell too. Afterwards, we're going to come back into the home, um, remove the tree um, when they're ready for it to go, and we'll do that completely free for the, the folks as well. That was the first of six trees they're giving away this year, but Randy and Connor are already planning on doing it again next year. I think it just, I got tears in my eyes, and I think it's wonderful that we're able to give to them, and they're just, they seem like a very needy family. She's very special to me, a very special, strong woman. Now this strong pine will help fill some of the dark days with light. There is still some time left to make a nomination as well. Awatuki Christmas Tree Removal just moved back their nomination deadline to this Friday. In Awatuki, I'm Spencer Blake for Arizona's Family.